Well, yesterday we told you about the heroic efforts by neighbors which saved a mother and her child from their burning home. As Christina Papa tells us, the community is now coming together to help rebuild what the fire has destroyed. Meet Amanda Yannick, her husband Robert, and their five-year-old daughter Riley. Yesterday, their lives were turned upside down when their home in Hazleton caught fire. In a heroic effort by neighbors in Hazleton's fire department, Riley and Amanda were rescued from the fire. The two were admitted into Lehigh Valley Hospital to be treated for smoke inhalation and have since been released. Today, the family can't go back to their home. The house sits empty here on Diamond Avenue after the fire destroyed all their belongings inside. Couldn't. I just looked at it and it was just all burnt and I was thinking that, you know, that's a home. That's a home just like the home I live in and, and that now they can't live there anymore. Sherry O'Donnell has known the family for years. She's little Riley's dance instructor. Great mom and dad always here at dance with her. Riley's here faithfully every week with a big smile on her face and um, just just great people. Cutest little girl ever. She comes every week, tries her hardest with a smile. She's always proud of herself, tries her best. Riley's friends have already drawn her get well cards. The kids for their age understood and were making posters, anything they can to help. It breaks your heart, like it makes you just want to cry, especially for little Riley, only five years old. Riley's not one to miss dance class, but while she recovers, her dance studio is hoping to raise funds so she can have the Christmas every child deserves. The dance company has begun to enlist help from other families. Her teachers say the families are concerned and want to help. We all are grateful for the blessings that we have, and when you see someone that has gone through something like this, uh, listen, even if it's a small donation, we can all give something. If you would like to donate, you can drop off items at the dance studio or just call the number at the bottom of your screen. When they come to the dance school, if they want to donate gift cards, cash, clothing, anything for them, um, they're just such a great family and have suffered this terrible fire. Christina Papa, News 13, Hazleton.